here. Legs, heels are going to be about 18 to 20 inches apart. Open those knees, toes are at a 45 degree angle. Okay, uh, elbows up just to balance. Okay, you're going to rock back on your heels, open up, drop that butt straight down through that hole. Okay, and then back up. Squeeze those glutes. Stand those heels, drop straight down. Good. Make sure you keep those knees behind your feet. Perfect. All right. Let's go ahead and wait. Let's get 15. Uh, on your back. Yeah, there you go. Move over a little bit, Corey. There you go. Okay, bring this left hand in. Let's put those pinkies on the rings, okay? Right there. Got it? Yep. Head up. Toes out. Head up. Keep it tight. Open those knees. Good. Just really stretch your glutes out. And then open up your groin and everything. There you go. Good. Keep your head up. Three. Good. Four. Remember, it's like pulling a band apart with your knees. Five. Good. Keep your head up. Four. Straight forward. Good. Make sure you exhale when you push. Inhale when you come down. Good job. Back it up. That's really important, y'all. Um, exhaling when you exert prevents your blood pressure from getting too high. So if your breathing gets out of whack, you know you actually put yourself at risk for a uh, for a stroke from that. So remember, make sure that you inhale when you're um, on your eccentric face, like the stretch, and then exhale when you exert. All right, you ready? Step set two. Move over, hold on, let's rack that back up. We want, we want that rough part to be centered. So, I know. Right there, okay? Toes out. Open your knees. You're going to drop that butt straight down between your heels. Good. Open those knees. Toes out a little bit more, Corey. There you go. You got it. Three. Open those knees. Four. You bring your heels closer together. There you go. Good Five. Good. There you go. Keep one of these apart. You don't even have to really get that low on these, just 90 degrees. Good. One more. Back up. Good. Lift it up. Five more sets forward. Butt's going to be done after this. Almost there. Oh yeah. I'm getting my squats in too. Right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get Corey. Three. This is four more sets that we're down. Okay. Okay. Ready? Let's go. See, guys, a full leg workout doesn't have to take very long, and you know, be as between sets. Ready? Let's go. Most people rest way too long playing around with their phones and talking to their, talking to their friends. We're taking Snapchat selfies. Exactly. <laughs> Hashtag no filter. Right? No, no, no. They always use filters, man. Like five My dude friend uses the dog filter in the gym. Like, what are you doing? Oh, I like the dog filter, too. I mean, I know, funny. I know, but it's just weird when it's in the gym. I know. When, when, I, take, when I take dog filter pictures, though, I'm like, It's a transformation. Right? How are we doing? Just don't do it. <laughs> Just don't do it. She's killing it, man. Oh, yeah. 
and all the movie games, <laughs> go get pizza after this. What's what's up do you get over at Firehouse? The Italian. Italian. Delicious. Yeah, I like Jimmy John's. No, well, I go to Jimmy John's because it's right by my house, but Firehouse is way better. Their BL, the BLT at Jimmy John's is clutch. I've never had it. It's like it's like just exactly the base necessities for the yeah. BLT, like over on the French, but I would say Firehouse is a better L for all sandwich so for sure. About, like, like I wouldn't ever get like a bacon only sandwich, just like just yeah. what I know about pork, you know. Jimmy John's is so fast. You walk in and you're Out. done in like three and a half seconds. Yeah, but Firehouse is better. Yeah, I think they did hot subs. Move over to your right just a little bit. No, at one place in Cal uh, left just a little bit. I did good. At one place in California, you sent me to Rubicon Deli. Oh my God. I'm not so good. I know. You're welcome. It was it was awesome. I ate so much food this day. Can you go toes out a little bit more? Ready? Let's go. I had some pancetta at the Republic Steakhouse on a salad last night. Oh, what a oh, dude! With some seared scallops, I would have died for those things, bro. They were so freaking delicious. Oh, or uh, I mean, open those in this corner. Um, have y'all been to the, the new uh, Brazilian Steakhouse here? Um, we went for uh, we went for my birthday for drinks and appetizers, but I have not I have not gone for the official like buffet thing. Your salad? Have you been there? There's, it's just like smoked meats and olives and anything else imaginable. And at lunch, it's half price of 30 bucks. Yeah. Are you ready? No. Yeah. Hey. I don't even go for the meat. I just like, like their salad is so good and their bread. Who doesn't like bread? Could live off of bread and cheese. Right? Two. Three. See, all of us fit people, we have that inner fat child that lives inside of us. Why do you think I'm at the gym? Exactly. <laughs> you gotta make that for it. I am. <laughs> well, there you go. Like, the more jacked you are, like, the more you probably... Well, like, you see, once you get jacked, though, then you can eat, like... I, how many how many California rolls did you have? Like twelve Cali rolls over at that over at that one place over how you roll. I saw you like pit down like ten Cali rolls. First time I met this dude, we met over at Freebirds, and he was like, "Oh, I ate already. I'm not gonna eat too much." Then he eats like he eats a super monster like by himself, and he's like, "Yeah, I eat like you know six thousand calories, you know, a day. No big deal." Watch me torch. Watch. <laughs> Hold my kale and watch this. Man, I remember, I remember a client. <coughs> we went to go get breakfast at this, at this place in Dallas. And um, it's like a little hole in the wall mm -hmm. at the bottom of a skyscraper. And she got pancakes and waffles, I think, and French toast, and then like eggs and stuff, and ate all of it. Oh, she ate more than me. I was like, what the hell? All I know is that French toast that they had at that place. It's it was so like good. coated yeah. in cinnamon sugar. Oh, oh my so God. So good. I tried to make that one time, but I couldn't. No. Was that in San Diego where you went? No, this was uh, in Galveston. Oh, okay. oh, yeah. And I went to that pancake place. The, and I got that, that apple that apple fritter pancake. Oh, I got the oh, banana yeah. foster one. <sighs> Oh, I love Banana Foster's pancakes. Have you, been, have you been to San Diego? No, I haven't. My uh, my cousin, uh, my cousin tra was a Navy SEAL training officer there for like a decade. Um, he, oh, is he there now? Yeah, he's coming in this coming weekend. Huh? That's awesome, dude. Um, oh my god, do you know what killer dolphins are? Open those knees. Do what? Do you know what killer dolphins are? Like an actual killer dolphin. Okay, so he was telling me about this. Um, like murderous dolphins. So like other countries sometimes will you know sit there you go rack it up. Will uh will send uh divers to kind of like spy or whatever like Russia. Uh huh. Okay. Well, the U.S. has these dolphins that are trained to find these divers and swim them to the surface super quickly and they die. 
on the way up. <laughs> like, these dolphins are trained to hunt divers and kill them. That's so funny. Yeah. I mean, it's not, but, like, it but is. Crazy. Because, like, like, you don't think of dolphins doing that. Well, because the dolphins, like, a lot of them, when they do that shit, like, this one, uh, she was, like, diving, and the way that they'll play with you, they'll, they'll like to mess with you, they'll, like, drag you, like, really far under the depths of the water really quick, and then they'll come out, like, flapping their flippers, like, laugh. They're like, oh, you got you so hard, bro. I'm like, dude, I almost <laughs> drowned. I don't, have, I don't have a blowhole. They're like, oh, I thought you, you're a mammal, I'm a mammal. Like, I thought we were just having some fun, man. Yeah, you get that. What's it called? That bins or whatever. Like your lines yeah, yeah. No, um, my uh, my ex was a scuba diver, and she said, "Yeah, you have to like, you can't be on an airplane x amount of time after you go scuba diving." All right. Anyways, on a less morbid note. <laughs> 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 yeah, we killed it. Thanks for watching, y'all. Hopefully, you uh, put this to good use down the road. All right, Phil. Let's Thanks. save. Let's save this. Uh, uh.